Christmas is just days away, so if you haven't already taken care of your gifts, it might be time to DIY. And here with Moore's crafting expert, Adina Anderson. So, Adina, okay, we've got last minute. What are yes. some fun things that we can do for well, going into Christmas first Eve? First thing you want to do, get a Christmas Eve box together, because every kid wants something to open Christmas Eve, right? So head over, grab a little shoe box. You probably have some in the house yeah. already. Wrap it up with some wrapping paper. And these are just some fun things. I got this at the container store. It's this little robot guy here. That'll keep them busy for hours. Oh, and so so it's, it's sort of like oh, stocking stuff. It you? is, oh, yeah. And you just fill the box. It gives them something to open that night. So it's really easy, really inexpensive. Look, it's got a little Christmas outfit for the next day and some markers. Just fun stuff. Popcorn, hot cocoa. You could throw in some cute little PJs. Yes, so exactly. Fun. Exactly. Oh, with some candy in it. Yeah, and then get put one of these projects in there for them to keep them busy. You know, or, or for gifts, these ornaments are great for the kids to make, for their relatives. Wait, we're making ornaments. We're making ornaments. Ornaments. Okay. Yay, fun stuff. That's what yes. this plastic thing is, right? That is an, just a plastic ornament, and you're going to fill it with some jelly bellies over there. And, you know, where do you find... Any uh, craft store has them, and they still have them, and they're uh, really, they're like 99 cents or 50, so they're really inexpensive. And they're yeah. really inexpensive now because it's almost Christmas, so everything's on sale. You know? Trying <laughs> they to have tape. Okay. Well, I'm going to get right. you started on the reindeer while she does that. Okay. So this is just some burlap ribbon here, and I cut it into triangles for you, and this is the little guy that you're going to make. This is the quickest, simplest ornament that you okay. can make. <laughs> Notice finish. she gave she gave Anna. me the easy one and right. you the hard one. <laughs> and so all you do is you can get these little clothes pins. Look how tiny these are. They're so cute. Any clothes? Where do you get any those? craft store? I got these at Michael's, I think. But you can get them at any craft store. Okay. And you just use and, these craft pins. Yep. These are deco art paint markers, okay. and you're going to draw your little circles for your eyes. Draw some eyes. Look at on that. Here. See how easy I that goes add on? Marshmallows, because that's what I'm doing. Oh yeah, you add whatever you will make it fun for the. Let Perfect. the kids make them. It makes it a lot of fun. And then, and then I'm gonna open. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna open your red just to show you. Okay. These are so cute. And these are just again fabric markers. These are actually um, you can use them on glass, wood, fabric, anything. These are deco art paint markers, so they use they're good for anything. Okay, Rudolph of course needs a red. Yes. Yeah, so use the tip of your paintbrush and just dab it in there. And what is this? Uh, this is the acrylic paint from deco. Art. Okay. And that's it. And then all you do is add your clothes pins. And you have some ribbon over there too under your burlap. Let me move that for you and reach over you. I hope you guys at home can see this okay. So look how oh, cute that is. Rudolph. Yes. Also, clothes pins are the ears. That's right, exactly. This is awesome. But how do you put it up on the Christmas tree? So now? all you need is this here. This is just some little um, twine, or you can use a little just, gold cord. A little gold cord, and you're gonna string it through here. Okay. And you may have to do that because I can't see it from here. Everybody knows me knows I wear reading glasses as well. <laughs> Bring it through. Okay. And then you just put that through. And then, of course, you know, you can head over to other places and get last minute things. There's places that are open on Christmas Day, you know, like Starbucks, Walgreens, things like that. I'm usually that person. <laughs> so, so you can go get a gift card and do that as well. And then just tie ornament. it at the top. That's it. How and easy look is at that? My fantastic. Look ornament. at that. It looks like a s'more. Yum. It's a mess, Jennifer Rose. It is not a mess, Derek Shore. <laughs> that is awesome. I bet it's going to be really I was yummy. I'm trying to mix it together. all up to make it look. Fine, <laughs> your Rudolph looks better than it looks great. Oh, it's terrible, but wait a minute. Is there any? I mean, is there any methodology to this? None whatsoever. Just fill it however you want. You know, you can get multicolored. No, it's pretty. It's, 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 you can't take. You it could back. even paint on this as Grinch. well. You are a Grinch. <laughs> No, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, duck back down. So put your hat back on. So it's just a plastic ball you fill with candy. That's it. Exactly. You could put a picture in there if you want, but no, just make it fun for them. You could fill it with ribbon. You can fill these with anything you want to make them okay, into a really so, cute Adina, I, is, I want some hot great. cocoa. It is, it is great. I'm kidding. Yeah. I want some hot cocoa. Or some oh, coffee, yes. right? Okay, so the hot cocoa, these are just little Wilton cake bags. Yeah. And you're just going to open. Now put your red jelly belly in the bottom there. Yeah, normally, these would be used for icing. That's you right. To decorate cakes. Uh -huh. cakes or, or, uh, okay. Sure. Okay. Right? And then this gets a little messy. Wait, what did you put in the bottom there? Jelly a little jelly. A little oh, jelly belly. Jelly belly. Okay. Yes. And then the hot cocoa. And your marshmallows. And your marshmallows. <laughs> oh, I get it. Are you making a little Rudolph? Oops. Oh, cool. This is really cute. Okay. Do I do a bunch of marshmallows or is that enough? How much? That's good. Okay. And then what? Is and this the last thing that goes? Oh, bless oh you. sorry. 
So w when you get this, d does someone, ours got a little mixed up here. There is a jelly, be <laughs> jelly belly down there. So it's a surprise. When someone gets this as a gift, it's a cute little Rudolph, but then the idea is they take the, the ribbon off and then they... Dump it all in the hot water. Dump it into hot water. And I'm losing my voice. <laughs> Sorry about the holidays. That. All part of the holidays. This is so cute, though. Oh. And then, as we can see in this fully completed Rudolph, you hot glued the... Glue dots. Oh, genius. So if Look. you don't have a hot glue gun at home, you can use little glue dots. And these are just pom-poms that you can get at the craft store and just go ahead and collect that. Yeah, don't, uh, don't dump the glue dots. <laughs> or the little fabric pom-poms down in and there, by the way. Make sure you use the jelly bean. All right, so Adina, thank you so much for these fun thank ideas. You. And I'm sorry I made fun of the ornament. It's I cool. It. I just, Jennifer Broom needs a little more work. For more info, Wrench. you can visit craftingwithadina.com. We'll be right back. <laughs> Nicely done. Thank you for the idea.